Hello and welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2, War of the Chosen, Long War of the Chosen to be precise. My name is Saikan and today we're continuing our run of the legendary Iron Man version of the mod. Time to hack a resistance computer and liberate uh, New India as well, which would be the second region where we are starting the liberation. To remind ourselves, we do have already one region liberated and this year plus in... Australia would be the next two that we're starting, so wish me luck as we're diving right into it. 16 to 18 enemies. Let's go, boys. Alright, so we got an access point down there which we need to hack. Don't have a direct hacker, uh, which means we need to fight our way through it. Um, sniper into position, I would... oh. I would argue we're going to go over here next. For the time being, let's move as close as possible to them. VDM moves up as well. We're moving our skirmisher. Snake Pliskin is being the one that is going to scout for us. All right. Looks like Snake has it well under control. And finally, their cry moves closer as well. All right. Good first uh, turn, if we can get a jump on these guys, that would be absolute awesome. Unfortunately with a drone that will be difficult, simply because they do have a lot of uh, detection ra radius. Might spot us out, yeah, okay. That's one of those XCOM bullshits where you are almost 100% certain that uh, the AI already knew that you're there and it uh, then quote unquote decided to just casually stroll along. Well, surveillance drone needs to go. Let's hit the sidewinder. Uh, not a kill, but uh, very close uh, to it. We're grappling over. Keep in mind the losts can be here as well. So I don't want to trigger them. Moves to here. Fortify just in case. Kill the Sidewinder. You're kidding me, right? Okay. Well, sometimes it is what it is. Very good. Okay, that's why you keep a backup plan, and my backup plan is... One action for that, destroy the loot, which is unfortunate. <coughs> One action for that, and hit and run for a straight up a kill. Lost are almost here. Better be careful, but we do have a uh, uh, flamer. That in itself should make our engagement with them much, much, much easier. So I'm thinking, shall we do some, get some? Or Oscar Mike reposition? Oh, 
there is another pack which we will need to engage at some point we're no longer hidden two more turns until we can pull us up again this would trigger the pack this here would not okay good if Pliskit moves up that also means nothing is triggered sniper goes into position VDM goes into position and death now uh, goes into position as well loss will likely come okay not a huge surprise Edwin is right behind here. Oh, could we hit them? No. Uh, first of all, checking who's a grappler. That's a dasher, dasher. Grappler, grappler, okay. Next up, can we? Can we somehow hit all four? The answer is no, but we can hit three, which given that we don't want to trigger advent, <coughs> might be the right thing to do this, plus then flamethrower. That takes out the brute as well. Good. Does not end the turn. My ammo is gone. But we know the pack of Advent is there, so... Uh, if we overwatch, that would kill uh, the brute which is fine might as well reload overwatch because i think we kill it with the first shot and then uh, the next one will at least go into advent good also means it doesn't run into us all right <clears throat> come closer take the shot and die VDM. Crazy. I wonder. <coughs> reinforcements are going to come in. So maybe it is the best to simply kill the drone and overwatch maybe and then next turn we're continuing problem is this uh, thing is burning so i just go here and here 
so that we're not exploding. Okay, what are we dealing with? Hmm. Relatively tough opponents. Well armored. We definitely require armor to penetrating rounds. That's good. Okay, does the other pack join them as well? Well, yes, because the truck is burning down. So at least we get our full money worth of shots because everything is has been moving uh, towards us BDM really good position here just gets it all down Good shot. That worked well. Into no, we're not. We're not uh, rip jacking. I unfortunately need to reload yet again, and then chain shot to kill him. And then we'll go with the placable in order to. Uh, move closer. The skirmisher is doing very, very well so far. We could uh, make him move out. It's kind of with a flush out shot. That would also uh, mean we're not we're not using any other uh, means such as frag grenades and so on I mean look that could be but I want to uh, keep that for the next loss because they are so incredibly good uh, the it is so incredibly good against the loss from one full cover to the other unbelievable Okay, let's try to kill him. Should be good. Soon we're going to get more enemies. We definitely already have um, the reinforcements inbound. BDM reloads. We're moving back. Reload Overwatch here. Overwatch. Death now. Uh, doesn't have free reload anymore, so we're reloading before then overwatching. And that's a bit of a problem because we wanted to use uh, the overwatch shots for the reinforcements, clearly. On the other hand, thinning out that pack isn't the worst idea.
Well, we got one overwatch shot um, off on Advent. Not a lot, but it is something. More reinforcements are coming very soon. Okay, listen. <clears throat> this here hopefully starts a little bit of a trend, which I would call get them down and make them pay. That's, a f that's hit and run triggering. Good, moving. Trooper. Nice, he goes down. Do we have him? Uh, no, we don't have him placable. Good, we're saving ammunition here. With Ripjack. Understood. Moving out. Fortify. And I mentioned it, I want to hit both of them with fire, which is good. This guy is now just completely out. No. Bit of an overkill, but we got death from above. The brute might die from uh, fire damage. Yeah, okay, that's good. Fantastic. Problem solved. One of them dies, the other one goes through, I think. and then we need to be out of here. Oh, that could be a good kill. And I hate Rocketeers. I got nothing. Remember how I said it could be a good kill? Right. We could do uh, the easy way, which is to move to here, but that we could also do with the EDM. Well, no, we could not. Guardian, Rocketeer. Let's get the Rocketeer.
Going for the Guardian. Remove that. We're moving back, mainly because I don't want to trigger anything else. Hand over an action to the DM. Finish the Guardian. Empty, empty, wonderful. That's that's really how you uh, wish that all of your missions go. Completely empty your Mac. Repositioning. See you later. to here kills the guy and we'll just bring Pliskit into safety that way everybody is in full cover and hopefully far enough away from Oh wow, well, far enough away from the stupid priest to not do stasis. What a nice pack of reinforcement that is. Not overpowered or anything. At this point uh, we definitely need magnetic weapons to keep up with the force level. There is only so much that I can do with the proper play. If we don't have the right weapons, we're just going to be overrun. And one easy way of Advent to achieve that is just throw too many hit points. Because even, like I already mentioned, even if you do have 100% accuracy, hit all of the shots, uh, play it perfectly. There is only so much, there's a mathematical value of hit points that you could uh, get down. And if set value is smaller than, uh, uh, if set value is larger than... Um, no, if that value is smaller than the hit points on the table, then of course you're going to have a problem. Well, we're done here. This is Firebrand. It's time to go. Alright, see you guys all a little bit later, we're done, we got what we came for and yeah we killed 32 enemies but there were 50 apparently and I'm sure there are even more. Wow, it's just when uh, the strength of a region begins to hit double digits, it's very difficult to get missions through. There's only so much you can do at this point. Big sleep. I like Dead Eye, which can help us to dish out more damage. 
That is also not bad, but we don't have an option to regularly do that. Does squad side count? Do confer the bonus. So, that's not bad either. I mean, that is de facto oftentimes a 30% crit bonus. Hmm. Aggression is good. I like it. How much damage bonus is this? Increase base damage of the shot by 50%. Oh yeah, okay, we're going to take that. Oftentimes I need like one really good uh, shot. VDM. Could get infighter, but we could also get dedication, which isn't bad. I don't think that we'll get anything else. Well, maybe we are. I don't know yet. Implacable, really good. Damage on critical hits, uh, that isn't bad either. Specifically with extra crit chance. But implacable, I value that very, very, very highly because repositioning means you can move into the right direction. You can always continue to flank. So we're going to use Im implacable. All right, that bond makes sense. And we got some decent loot out of it. Nothing like outrageously good, but decent. Shortly back to the drawing board here. Uh, that means this region is ready for uh, the second, uh, the second liberation mission. And we shall continue with exactly that. South Africa, let's do some more recruitment. Okay, scanning here with uh, 10 plus four due to the Avenger, that's 14. We should see missions popping up. We want to set back the aliens work on the Avatar project. We should hit one of their facilities as soon as possible. The aliens have dedicated an immense amount of time and resources to this project. Nice infirmary. Commander, the infirmary can be used to improve the recovery process of our wounded soldiers. And over time, they'll also recuperate from any negative con... Delta combat. We can also speed up the process through therapy if needed. Look. All of a sudden, the wound times are much, much, much more manageable. But currently, we do have a good roster, so we're uh, actually not requiring that much time. Um, 13, 12, that's one day. Nah, let's continue with that. We still have five scientists, which is not massive, but it is also not that bad. I feel we're pretty much on the mark at the moment. East uh, Asia, New Indonesia. All right. So. And East Asia is over here. Double checking for completeness whether or not we have some recruits. No. Nope. Lead by example is our collector. Hmm. I mean, the collector thing grants Intel continuously, so I guess that's not bad. It's a little bit of Intel, but the aim will, will is okay. Aim, his aim is okay either. Might be a few points here and there. The hex certainly doesn't matter, but 
yeah we're going with uh, lead by example again and we're ready for dying pyre which is uh, the gray knights going in uh, to a very 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 infiltrated mission uh, to get some experience out of it but that happens in the next episode for now we're at the end of today's episode thank you very much for watching appreciate it and uh, see you very soon bye bye